highly recommend that people come and see the Bowerbird and the Bri because the, the, the designs are just simply fantastic. So the exhibition features 45 dresses from the 1880s or 1890s to 1970s. I think uh, take your time to wander through and have a look at the, the way that the dresses are made. From a dressmaker's perspective it's lovely to see how they do things in the olden days. Beautiful. Wonderful. Mm. It's amazing, mm. actually. Absolutely gorgeous. The attention to detail of the dresses and the accessories and just having the backdrop of government house. It felt like you were in the certain areas. I just could imagine, um, you know, the bride, the way the fabric would have moved as she danced the bridal waltz with her new husband. That's very beautiful. Yeah, lots of photos that look like grandma's photos, wedding photos. Yeah, it's beautiful. It's a wedding garden party today. So everyone's dressing up in their wedding finery, some from the 1920s. There's swing dancing lessons and people are playing croquet on the lawn. We've got bands and music, all sorts of things to do and we've bought a magnificent picnic with linen tablecloths and silverware and candelabra and wedding cake. And it was fantastic, um, great event. We all dressed up. Uh, Donna made all these dress just last night for the event. And uh, yeah, it's great, really enjoyed it. What a fantastic day. <laughs> Any excuse to dress up. <laughs> and we didn't even yeah. care if no one dressed up. Yeah. We were just coming like this. <laughs>